1939, the brilliant animation pioneers Max and Dave Fleischer took a break from Popeye and Betty Boop to tackle the story of Gulliver's adventures in Lilliput. Two years earlier, Disney's classic Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs raised the bar for all animated features to follow. Still, Fleischer Studios was up to the challenge. The result is a gorgeous 76-minute feature, the first of its type from an American studio other than Disney. It earned two Oscar nominations, including one for Victor Young's musical score. This is really something special. From 1939, here's Gulliver's Travels. Why do they make 
make me sing that song. The poet who wrote it was certainly wrong. It's bright ahead, go right ahead. I'd rather go home and go right to bed. <laughs> They're signing a wedding contract? There's a giant on the beach!
Exquisite taste. Exquisite. Roses, freshes, rhododendrons, ranunculus, snapdragons, and daisies. <laughs> Posies, aren't they? Beautiful blooms. Beautiful. Gaining a son. My son, David. Played at the wedding tomorrow. Of course, of course. Oh, what's that? Faithful? Oh, no, no. Forever, the song of Blefuscu must be played at the wedding. But, Bombo, Faithful is always played at our weddings. It's tradition, sir. And it's very pretty. Yes, yes, I know. Pleasant little ditty, but hardly appropriate for this great occasion. But forever, there's a song for you. Ha ha! Ha ha. Faithful will be played. Ah, twaddle. Absolute twaddle. It must be forever. Faithful. Forever. Faithful. Forever. Forever, or there will be no wedding. Uh, no wedding, but the cake and the pretty flowers and uh, oh, Bombo, you love faithful. I
back like a duck. But, but, um, but I'm trying to tell you. I'm telling you, there's, there's a... What's on your mind? I say... Speak up, man. There's a giant on the beach. There's a giant on the beach. For heaven's sake, Gabby, button your mouth. Can't you see I have a war on my hands? Uh, be off with you. Uh, shoo, 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 shoo. A war? Do you suppose he'd be a, a spy? Or... They bother me with passion. Touch it. Who's a spy? Who's a spy? The giant on the beach! The giant? Giant? Why don't you tell me these things? Uh, do something. Don't stand there. Go see the dogs on the... Uh, fetch them to me at once. Bring cables and tools, bring horses and mules, bring snippers and clippers, ladders and spools. Bring Derek to ring, bring 
boys, a jig, bring what you call it, little and big, a thingamabud, a thingamajig, and all kinds of things and stuff like that there. Oh me! Quiet, quiet, quiet. 
Your Majesty. Uh, I've got the giant. Uh, the giant? Uh, oh, oh, yes, yes, the giant. Uh, well, bring him in. Bring him in. Okay, okay. Your Majesty, I don't think he'd fit in here. Oh, you don't, huh? So it's not good enough for him, hmm? Well, where is he? Out there, Your Majesty.
Understand that not until that giant is removed can our forces taste the sweet fruits of victory. Now then, it is up to you to carry this message to my spies in Lilliput. Be off, and may luck be with you. Get going. I'm sorry the little princess isn't with us. Uh, yes, too bad. Uh, too much excitement for one day.
blue birds in the moonlight. That's how I feel when I'm with you.
I see that you're a sailor boy. I own the boat, a beauty, too. Fifty times as big as your, uh, as big as your, uh, as big as your shoe. My, my. I, I lost her, though, in a furious gale. But I came home on the back of a whale. But tell me how you caught the whale. Simply grabbed a hold of his tail. My, I climbed a mountain peak so high, I bumped my head against the sky. And there I was. Where was I? On the island of Alibi. Hi, hi. My, my. Hi, hi. But now my life is very dull. They ought to make me an admiral. Now that's the job that I'd enjoy. I must be going. Ahoy, ahoy. My, my, my. You put that ball in there. And then it goes down and around. Pull that thing. <laughs> and it comes out here. <laughs> <laughs> Anybody in there? Nobody here but just us. Chickens! My, my.
of war, too. That makes it worse. Carry on the search, men. Mind you, your father will hear of this. and a wedding broken by a melody? Incredible. Wait a minute. I have an idea that might turn this malice to a melody. Sing faithful and forever together as one song. will be a dead dog. Ha! Now we are getting at somewhere. Dear spies, destroy, crush, obliterate, annihilate! Hear him. I will attack at dawn. Affectionately yours, Bombo. Bombo's attack, but, but, uh, guards, guards, guards! Bombo's attacking! Bombo's attacking! Bombo's attacking at Bombo's attacking! It's war! Bombo's attacking! It's war! It's war! The enemy attack! To the beach! To the beach! Bombo's attacking! What? Bombo's attacking! It's war! It's war! To the beach! To the beach, the enemy attack! To defend Lilliput. Yes, forward march.
peacefully. Listen. Hold your fire. Hear what I have to say. little people. Look what you've done. Now go ahead, break your nutshell heads over your songs. But did you have to break Glory's heart, King Little? Because you're thoughtless and selfish? And you, Bombo, 
Oh, mighty warrior. What have you won? You were too stubborn to think, too busy quarreling to lend ear to the harmony that might have been yours. But now, in your sorrow and despair, perhaps you'll listen to your songs as they might be sung. Peoples of Blefusco and Lilliput, with eternal gratitude and love in our hearts, we christen thee Gulliver. Though Gulliver's Travels was a success at the box office, it couldn't cover the excessive production costs. Not only had the Fleischers enlisted nearly 700 artists, they had a new studio built in Miami to accommodate the new personnel. They ended up over budget and over stressed. Still, when you consider that Gulliver's Travels was made with only half the budget of Snow White and done in one third the time, Max and Dave Flesher showed that they could have given Walt Disney a real run for their money. This is the Film Detective. Stay with us.